Well, award show season is upon us, and while Amanda and I are busy picking out our outfits for the red carpet, sure. <laughs> the boys from Bull Moose have been at work picking out their winners. <laughs> and outfits, I, I know. We're going to be on the red carpet. Come yeah. on. Right. Of course you are. Right. Right. We're ready. Yeah, I don't definitely. think we need to work on this anymore. <laughs> no, this is great. Yeah. Let's start with the big one. Yeah. The one that a lot of people fall asleep before it's announced. <laughs> the best motion picture. Right. We've got in the list Ford versus Ferrari, The Irishman, Jojo Rabbit, Joker, Little Woman, Marriage Story, 1917, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, and Parasite. Let's start with you, a Mick. Long list. It is a, it is a long list. So uh, a couple of years ago when we did the show, I was like, Arrival definitely going to win Best Picture because uh, I always vote with my heart. You're still carrying uh, that around <laughs> with you, I can tell. It's a great movie. People should watch it. Anyway, uh, but this year, my heart and I think what the critics will pick align. Uh, I, I think Parasite. There is just it's wow. there's all ten movies are incredible, right? Uh, but Parasite is like a league above. Um, Bong Joon Ho, incredible director, and he, he honestly he deserves it more than anybody else. He 100 percent deserves it. And should scare everybody is we completely agree on this. Yeah. So wow. on 207, <laughs> when you watch Academy Awards show, you got to wait till 1130. 207, we already know now. Yeah, we, we got it. Yeah, yeah, we got Obviously it. Obviously, it's Parasite. <laughs> That's Definitely the winner. It's an incredible movie, but if some travesty of justice happens, 1917 or... <laughs> no my, pressure yeah. or anything. <laughs> yeah, no, no pressure. Okay. Yes, that's right. All right. Next up, I think we're going to go to actor in a leading role. Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh, and the list is, I'm sorry, I should read you, and ten, Antonio Banderas, Leonardo DiCaprio, Adam Driver, Joaquin Phoenix, and Jonathan Price. So what are you guys going for? Well, on this one, I think there, there's a, a big uh, controversy among uh, Hollywood about Netflix movies and whether or not they should win major awards. I think this is going to be the first time that's kind of broken and that Adam Driver will win for Best for Actor, he that he was incredible in Marriage Story, and that his performance is so strong, I think that the Academy will just be swayed by that and say, like, we'll, we'll throw a bone Netflix's way. Okay. See, I went with Joaquin Phoenix. Um, I, Joker... Not best picture material uh, as a winner, because it's a nominee, but he carried that entire movie on his shoulders. Um, and what's interesting about that is there's not a single scene in the entire movie that Joaquin isn't in. So he is he is all encompassing in that movie, and he'd be a deserving winner yeah. too. Un unlike the best you know best picture where we're like it must be it must yeah. be Parasite. It must be Joaquin Parasite. would absolutely he's incredible. Well, I also want to say that I've, I didn't see it, most of these, but I did see Marriage Story, and I agree with you. Adam Driver was sensational in Amazing. that movie. Amazing. So yeah. notable snub in this category, Adam Sandler, and I'm not kidding. Right. Adam Sandler in right. Uncut Gems absolutely killed it and you don't think of adam sandler as a as a true serious actor mm -hmm. but he but he 100 percent got the snub yeah. in this category yeah. interesting okay all right we'll move on to actresses in a leading role cynthia arrivo is that how you say her name in harriet yeah, that's what yeah. we think scarlett johansson marriage story saoirse ronan in little women charlize theron in bombshell and renee zellweger in judy yeah, this to me is uh, Renee Zellweger is going to walk away with it. Hollywood she's loves she's giving she's awards to things she's about she's Hollywood, she's and uh, she's and she's so check check box number one. They also love kind of comebacks from excellent she's actors great. and actresses, no and she is just fantastic in the role of Judy Garland and uh, incredibly compelling. What do you think, Meg? You know, you convinced me on this one, and I was also <laughs> thinking about how like you know Sandler got the snub, and and Renee Zellweger is like a former like rom com actress to come in mm -hmm. and show some serious chops. You're right. It's, it's a comeback story. Win. She really <laughs> just was Judy Garland in yeah, that movie. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. On to directors. We have for directing The Irishman, Martin Scorsese, Todd Phillips for Joker, Sam Mendes for 1917, Qu uh, Quentin Tarantino for Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, and Bong Joon-ho for Parasite. So I would have Let said, me guess. <laughs> no, so yes, so exactly. I, I would have said Bong Joon-ho because it, incredible director, incredible movie. But I actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tip it to Sam Mendes here because the direction in 1917 is an incredible achievement. I, I don't know if you know this, but the whole movie is framed like it's one continuous shot. So it follows soldiers from like a point behind the trenches, through the trenches, across the line, through the German trenches. And to construct a movie like that is an incredible achievement. And it's it's totally believable too. I mean, there obviously there are like 
scenes where you can feel like, okay, well, that's where they yelled cut. But it doesn't look like that while you're watching the movie. Unbelievable. Where, where I, I think your points are absolutely valid and it's deserving. However. But, no, but actually, I think uh, Tarantino's going to win because, again, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, they yeah. love, like, it's the Academy show and they love giving awards to movies to about, themselves. yeah, to themselves. Yeah. yeah. Apparently don't love nominating women to this category, though. No. Greta Gerwig yeah. absolutely Another deserved a nomination. It for Little Women. And, yeah. Correct. Uh, well worth noting that if, if I'm right and Joaquin wins, uh, the character Joker will have more Oscar wins than women have for directing. Wow. Which is, yeah. come Greta, on. Something is wrong. Come on. Snub. Yeah. What's that? Who do you think is the biggest snub? I actually snub agree that that's the Greta, biggest yeah. snub. Yeah, yeah. Greta is. Yeah, for yeah. sure. She's an incredible okay. director and, and yeah. That, well, there, there were, oh, were you I was going to say shouts out to Robert Pattinson getting the snub for The, the Lighthouse. That was, the, he should have gotten something for that too. Best supporting. <laughs> Maybe we should have another show. We should have a lot of chips yeah. on his shoulder. I got a lot yeah. of chips yeah. on my shoulder. Yeah, 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 yeah. We should give them some feedback. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, come on Academy. <laughs> February 9th, the Oscars. Guys, thanks for coming in. Really appreciate it. And 207, we'll be right back.